Shat Chakra Nirupanam describes the three fundamental energy pathways inside the human body, Ida, Pingala and Sushumna in exquisite detail. In this video, we are going to explore in detail various mystical attributes of these three Nadis. The Sanskrit channel is an effort to explore a wide variety of topics from original Sanskrit literature. If you wish to support this effort, consider becoming a sponsor on Patreon or make a one-time contribution through these options. Your support will help us improve the quality, length and number of topics covered in our videos. Do check out all the links in the description below. The first shloka from Shat Chakra Nirupanam goes as follows. Meror Bahya Pradeshe Shashi Mihira Shire Savya Dakshe Nishanne Madhye Nadi Sushumna Tritaya Gunamayi Chandra Suryagni Rupa Dattura Smera Pushpa Grathita Tama Vapuh Kanda Madhya Chirastha Vajrakhya Medha Deshat Chirasi Parigata Madhya Meshya Jvalanti The first line says on both sides, Savya and Daksha, at the outer corner, Bahya Pradesha, of Meru, which here means the spinal column, lie Ida and Pingala, representative of the moon and the sun, respectively. Madhye, in between them, is the Sushumna Nadi, which has all the three properties of Sattva, Rajas and Tamas, which is a combination of the three properties of sun, moon and fire, Chandra, Surya, Agni. It is compared to the Datura flower, which is white and hollow in the middle, arising from a bulb or kanda at the bottom. It is also called as the lightning or vajra that shines in the middle, spreading from the root chakra to the top of the head. This shloka describes the presence of Sushumna Nadi in between Ida and Pingala. The second shloka describes Chitrini and Brahma Nadis that reside inside Sushumna. It goes something like this. Tanmadhye Chitrini Sa Pranava Vilasita Yoginam Yoga Gamya Luta Tantupa Meya Sakala Sarasijan Meru Madhyanta Rasthan Bhitva Dedi Pyatetat Grathana Rachanaya Shuddha Bodha Swarupa Tanmadhye Brahmanadi Hara Mukha Kuharad Adi Devanta Ratma Inside this Vajra or Sushumna is Chitrini Nadi, which is the embodiment of Pranava or the primordial sound, a combination of A, U and M. Um. She is also depicted as a goddess who is seen as the destination of all yogis, yoginam yoga gamya. Luta in Sanskrit means a spider and tantu is a thread. This shloka describes that this chitrini nadi is fine and subtle as a spider's thread. This thread penetrates all the sarasijas or lotuses which mean the chakras which are present along the spine. Inside this shining Chitrini, which is in turn present inside the Sushumna Nadi, is what is called as the Brahma Nadi, which originates in the form of Hara at the bottom of the spine and extends until the form of Adideva at the top of the head. This Brahma Nadi is the path through which Brahman or the Self enters and exits the physical body. The third shloka describes this Brahma Nadi in further detail. It goes like this. Vidyun Mala Vilasa Muni Manasi Lasat Tantu Rupa Susukshma Shuddha Jnana Prabodha Sakala Sukhamayi Shuddha Bodha Swabhava Brahmadwaram Tadasye Pravilasati Sudha Dhara Gamya Pradesham Granthisthanam Tadetat Vadanamiti Sushum Nakya Nadhyala Panti At the top of this Brahmanadi, which is extremely subtle like a fine thread, which shines with the brilliance of a lightning, is the entrance called Brahmadwaram. Through this Brahmadwaram flows Sudha or the nectar of life. Its nature is that of Shuddha Jnana or pure knowledge and it provides Sakala Sukha or all kinds of pleasantness within. In summary, we have learnt about the components of Sushumna, the Chitrini Nadi and the Brahma Nadi and also about the Brahmadwaram which is present at the top of the head. Energizing these components is seen as the objective of yoga. In upcoming videos, we will start understanding shlokas corresponding to each individual chakra in exquisite detail. If you wish to support the production of more videos like these, consider becoming a sponsor on Patreon or make a one-time contribution all through the links in the description below. Consider subscribing to the Sanskrit channel where we explore a wide variety of topics from the vast world of diverse Sanskrit literature. See you in the next video. Namaskaram.